Limitless is an engineering innovation nonprofit that's based here at the University of Central Florida. And our goal is to make bionics that are both artistically expressive as well as really, really functional and be able to deliver them to families at no financial burden to them through our clinical research. We have several Project Lead the Way alumni who in their high school programs or even their middle school programs got an early experience into what they could be as an engineer. And when they come to Limitless, they get to start to put those skills into application throughout that process. I think Project Lead the Way definitely implemented like a mindset very early on. Um, it was very much project-based and it was very collaborative. Definitely getting like a lot of that hands-on experience was really useful to me because it kind of, it just helped me show like what engineering was about. By having opportunities like Project Lead the Way in my high school, those teachers were helping train students to ultimately become engineers in the future. Here at Limitless, now we have 40 of those students all working towards inclusive design, being able to use engineering to help others, and even be able to transform the conversation around accessibility needs and disability. Project Lead the Way just really connected stuff in school and put context behind it. From what we learned in our Project Lead the Way experience, we tried to build on that project-based learning, the critical thinking, being able to kind of coach out the great ideas from students and to give them the confidence to, to take on the challenge. I've been given a lot of projects where I had to work and collaborate with others, which is what I had to do with Project Lead the Way. So I think that was very translatable. Albert being in Project Lead the Way is very inspiring. Uh, it kind of shows me like what I can do with that knowledge to nurture that engineering component of your mind, you have to be given the opportunity to explore and to create and develop and the confidence that it's okay to fail and to be able to learn from the, those moments and then be able to build on them. And you start to build on that foundation and you start layering piece by piece until ultimately you get something that can really change the world.